Good morning and welcome to Live with Lucky. Happy Tuesday, May 3rd. Great to see everyone this morning. Let's go ahead and get started with our Pledge of Allegiance followed by our Shamrock Pledge. All right, scholars, everyone is quiet. We are standing, ready, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. And now our Shamrock Pledge. We are the scholars of Shamrock Gardens. We are dedicated, committed, and focused. We prepare for greatness by doing our best every day. We cooperate with our classmates, teachers, and staff. We respect ourselves and all people. We know that hard work is the key to success. There are no limits to how far we can go. We dream big, believe and achieve. We will graduate from high school and be college and career ready. We will succeed. Lunch today, chicken nuggets. If you choose that, you get an artisan roll and some steamed broccoli. Um, if you don't care for nuggets, you have your choice of the yogurt, cheese and granola bag, the plain hummus and sunflower seed bag, wow butter and grape jelly or the veggie pinwheel fruits today are fresh grapes and tropical trio cool tropics slush it is character talk tuesday and as we are wrapping up the school year it's very important for us to revisit these so we have cycled through all of these and we are back to the top um, in our book of code of student conduct we're going to be talking about respect responsibility and caring today. Um, these are the cornerstones of good character. Um, so, 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 so uh, important. So I have included some illustrations this morning to kind of um, capture the meaning of all three of these. Um, however, they, they can uh, extend beyond what I have put here. So for respect, I have respect is when you treat other people like you want them to treat you, and that's true. Um, you don't have to be someone's best friend, but you do need to treat people uh, the way that you want them to treat you. So there in that illustration, we have some scholars sharing some school materials there. Responsibility, it looks like um, this scholar here in the middle has uh, made a mess and spilled looks like some cereal and he spilled it, right? So he is being responsible and cleaning up his mess. He's not expecting his parents to clean it up. Um, responsibility also, um, if we're talking about school, is doing your homework and making sure that you are doing the things that you need to do. The more responsible you are um, shows how much more mature you are, okay? Responsibility is a lot, um, but you can do it and you feel super awesome afterwards. And then caring, we have the scholar here who has fallen and scraped their knee and their friend has brought them a Band-Aid. And so caring just means like, Showing that you, uh, you know, have feelings or, or can empathize with that person and know that, man, I bet his knee hurts, so I'm going to get him a Band-Aid. So caring can look uh, very different in uh, multiple ways, but um, these three are the three that we want to be sure that we are checking ourselves, making sure that we are being respectful, responsible, and caring for one another. We hope that everyone has an awesome day of teaching and learning. Don't forget it's Teacher Appreciation Week. Give your teacher a hug, a high five, tell them how awesome they are. And we will see you tomorrow on Live with Lucky. Bye.